sir experience is uh, is very uh, like as fa- fabulous sir. like in the when we say the quality of education and affordable price you guys like sir you just you, you never told this like you made it possible sir like it was very easy question i knew about it but i don't know the funda- fundamental like hmm. how the things is happening behind the scene so hmm. they has asked about the estimal cases but and i feel so like uh, uh, like uh, disappointed on that time why and you not able to prepare about it i was prepared for javascript react but hmm. the basics fundamental was not prepared so hmm. always focus on your basic fundamental hmm. first believe upon your strategy consistent hmm. is the key of build success in any domain what is the best decision yeah so take taking a web application for my user So hello guys we have uh, Abhishek with us who has recently got transition as a software engineer in a campus placement so we'll get to know more about Abhishek we'll get to know like what was his strategy of preparation and many more things so welcome Abhishek thank uh, you sir Abhishek uh, to start with uh, just give us about brief about your introduction like your uh, background and all okay so like uh, hi everyone my name is Abhishek Bhuiya and I completed my bachelor's of science from uh cloud technology information security and right now i'm pursuing my ma- master in computer application from century university of technology management bhubaneswar and basically i'm from uh, odisha state uh, odisha and uh, i was currently in uh, bhubaneswar location and uh, recently i got uh, selected in capgemini and uh, i have a interest area of interest work in web application and uh, i was been prepared for the javascript full stack developer for my newton uh, i have been uh, preparing for my newton so Okay, perfect, perfect. So when we talk about web stack development, right? Full stack web yeah. development, right? Yes, sir. So how was the experience till now with respect to learning? Ah, uh, sir, experience is ah uh, is very ah uh, like is fa- fabulous. Sir. Like in the when we say the quality of education and affordable price, you guys like sir, you just you you never told this. Like you made it possible, sir. Like ah uh, when I enroll in this course, I never have a idea like how our doubt will be clear and all mm-hmm. later on i was in the coding ninjas i was doing my data structure from coding ninjas they mm-hmm. have done assistance and quick assistant manner but mm-hmm. in i knew on in the initial stage we have a uh, every day we have a 6 hours of doubt clearing section like mm-hmm. which is uh, in different manner like it is fabulous and mm-hmm. after that we have a different one to one section to clear our doubts and having a lots of food in the class still i got a uh, chance to interact with my mentors sir. which is mm. which is even it's a very uh, good strategy from your side to introduce mm. any courses and giving more emphasis to each and every students okay amazing amazing yes, uh that's that's so so nice of you abhishek abhishek can you talk about your interview experience with cap gemini and how did you sir, manage it yes sir uh, basically when uh, as a fresher when you go for any interview so basically you have to focus on your basics uh, basics first like if you are from computer applic- uh, computer bank the it id background so basically mm-hmm. like your data structures your core fundamentals operating systems or any networking concept even though you are from uh, any particular domain like you are from web application or you are from ai ml or data science any any background you have to first focus in your fundamental first so basically mm-hmm. for a service based companies uh, or uh, any like uh, spcs or any cap gemini mm-hmm. or they straight forwardly ask for your basics first after mm-hmm. that they will be more uh, uh, question about your domain subject so basically in my interview they started with a basics uh, fundamental first then mm-hmm. they start suddenly uh, go straight forward to the uh, project which i have been mentioning sir mm-hmm. so uh, like uh, with respect to the interviews right uh, what was the most difficult question that was asked to you uh, sir basically uh, it was from a cloud background question like uh, when i was uh, when interview by them they asked me about a question like uh, when you were wave i was been uh, i have introduced one of my project which was been a life example project like it was mm-hmm. a, a big uh, main college implement uh, implementation project like it's a, a living uh, living management like type project like something he told me mm-hmm. like if uh, someone is like uh, if your uh, wave application is down for some hours like if you want to uh, means uh, like contact to your uh, users like how they like from this amount of time to this amount of time 
your application is down and uh, your server is down mm-hmm. how you incl- uh, like inform them like i don't have that knowledge about the, uh, that thing but i have the basic knowledge about that like you can deploy your application and uh, create a topic in your aws accounts and uh, if someone is logging to your account they have uh, we have information about the numbers and all we can directly uh, link into it but that mm-hmm. is another concept is available is that that you can route 53 like we are mm-hmm. we can give the route about the particular pages on a particular amount of time like mm-hmm. i get to know about this uh, fun, uh, like concept when i go depth in the knowledge of web application i may be correct in this sense but yeah that was something i lacked behind on that time okay amazing amazing so uh, what challenges did you face in your learning journey right and how did you overcome that so basically uh, when i was learning from i knew run and my college like uh, college mm. is 8 hours in uh, india we have 8 or 9 hours of college mm. like so mm. in saturday and sundays we have our classes mm-hmm. and saturday still have i have my colleges so what i do like uh, sunday i have uh, i have like my faculties help me a lot i told mm. like i have preparing for the uh, web applications earn and i have my courses please give me uh, the leave for saturdays and mm. what i do like i do my courses like i do my college from 8 to 9 mm. and uh, when i come my uh, uh, home i had my gym and uh, physical mm. activity i do all mm. these things the mm. night i every day give to do 2 to 3 hours to my personal goals like which area in which domain i interest mm. for every day 2 mm. to 3 hours i do mm. uh, study for it sir and uh, in this manner i able to uh, get a knowledge about the uh, domain of food application amazing so you are focusing on your health also and every day yeah sir like i <laughs> recently right. transformed myself from i have a youtube channel even sir like i have mm-hmm. a 1.5 million sub view on one by one of one of my videos sir okay like, amazing yeah. amazing great 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 so how did i neuron help you in this specific sir journey? basically when i uh, started for my masters like i always having a uh, interest in web application of web developer Hmm. so i always start with initially like uh, learning html and css starting with the initial phases of web application web development so hmm. every time i don't have the structured guided path like so mm-hmm. where i like uh, i started with html css after one uh, month or half, half a month i get like no it's very hard to do i don't have that knowledge after yeah. html css of where i need to go what should hmm. i need to prepare for like what hmm. some type of projects should i do so hmm. uh, on uh, like i was scrolling in youtube i got to know about itis uh, like is doing uh, 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 courses in i neuron and all so mm-hmm. before uh, uh, like joining i neuron be- before uh, joining anima before that 15 days i had a purchase a course of model web development from uh, that uh, learn code online mm-hmm. so after that i got to know about i neuron then i learn about like i enroll in uh, that course and mm-hmm. i uh, see the structural guided path and mm-hmm. it was like amazing sir the structural way and the projects you have been mentioned in the course and uh, like uh, while the difficulty level of the courses is goes higher uh, mm-hmm. while we go behind uh, the mm-hmm. uh, p- particular courses sir. like it was like uh, the more you learn the more you get in your uh, knowledge but in this i knew run the teachers the mentors they will put your hand with you like mm-hmm. they will make you work with them okay so nice of you so nice of you so uh, this is quite amazing like uh, your learning was exponentially increasing along yeah, so with like, that you are specifically getting the hand holding and all that is specifically required for any students as such exactly okay now let's go to the uh, next uh, topic right how did you manage your studies and <laughs> course preparation parallelly you know sir like uh, as i am from it background like sir uh, mm. i am from master in computer application so mm-hmm. basically when i joined uh, uh, i knew run i was in my third second semester and that time uh, as accidentally in the sec- second semester in our college we have mm-hmm. a domain subject so mm-hmm. i took a software development domain where mm-hmm. i have the same curricular activities as we have in the uh, I, like mm-hmm. we have the software technology react javascript everything was there similar at that time mm-hmm. so uh, as a college you need to uh, work on the grades and you have some face value in front of mm. your uh, teachers to get a mark and grade up so i every day i do my uh, classes i have 75% mm. of attendance compulsory in the college i do mm. even though i study in the college i have 2 to 3 mm. hours of gap in my college i took my laptop mm. and everything and mention the things which have been taught in saturday sundays and sir the mentors of ours always tell us that you what the thing we need to do in that 5 days of your working day so mm. i mention everything in my diary 
and mm. i kept inside it and i uh, schedule it by monday tuesday when i the one i need to do it so mm. uh, every day basically one hour i get for my college hours and mm. uh, basically and two to three hours in my uh, night uh, like i used to study in my personal time amazing amazing great uh, <clears throat> that is like you have managed it perfectly right with respect to preparing both college syllabus and this perfect okay. so yeah, any study tips who do you like to share with the other audience right who are yeah, actually like, preparing and probably to get a job you know okay so basically i was from web application like i was interested i will rather say in the web application right? so hmm. if like if you are preparing for any web application uh, any domain the first you have to be more uh, confident among yourself like yeah you can hmm. do it first believe upon like hmm. believe is the first key second mm. you have to be consistency on your work what you are doing about it mm. like if uh, this your mentor told to do all these things stuff in this particular time of span you have mm. to do it and mm. you have to constantly believe on them that no no that like if they are like is this a website they are giving you like if you think like no you not need to, need not to do that like it's a easy task for us no you need mm. to do it mm. even the same mistake i have been done in past uh, one month sir like i was not in the track a task sir like mm. i missed one interview from my new run site said it's mm. a very easy question mm. but i was been uh, health issue for my site like i was not prepared for it it mm. was for sir like html css part it was very easy question i knew about it but i don't know the fund- fundamental like mm. how the things is happening behind the scene so mm. they has asked about the html css part and i feel so like uh, uh, like uh, disappointed on that time why and you're not able to prepare about it i was prepared for javascript react but mm. the basics fundamental was not prepared so mm. always focus on your basic fundamental mm. first believe upon your strategy consistent mm. is the key of build success in any domain amazing amazing great so i hope uh, the audience will definitely take the steps from you now let's go ahead uh, we can play a small rapid round you know so rapid round yes, quickly i will ask a question you have to quickly answer it okay, okay you, sir. you okay. don't have to think okay whatever things come in your mind first of all just say that okay, okay so let's start first point what is the key to success consistency in consistency perfect second one what is the best decision yeah sir, take taking it. a web application for my user okay perfect who is your role model apj abdul kalam sir okay perfect uh, any one thing that comes in your mind about web development so it's a future of uh, any any industry okay, any perfect. startup what is your future vision so my future vision is uh, now uh, like i was studying for the front end my future vision to be a, a good in full stack web uh, development sir i want to be master in front end and back end i have to work uh, more over in the wave application wave 3 is like uh, more kicking in this uh, era sir like mm. i have to more enhance in my knowledge about the wave 3 and that's still uh, my future plans great great and final question is that anything that uh, like what is the thing that comes in your mind about tiny run sir you guys are doing really hard work for us sir like keep on doing this uh, work for us really lots of students still want you to uh, like still lots of uh, college and lots of uh, small level of college need i knew run from their college side sir the way you are uh, be- becoming the like like easier sir no one no in- institutions are doing this sir like from web every type of domain if you think about i knew run is providing that not only in the affordable price but also with the qualities of study sir that that's one of the base key thing i even from my side sir like um, two to five uh, two to four of my friends have been enrolled by my side from my new uh, in i knew run sir and they even like the uh, course and fundamentals sir so, like they Perfect. you guys are doing very well sir thank you abhishek for your kind feedback yes, and obviously we'll be working more we'll be striving more hard to provide good education to everyone uh, we believe as it, possible we believe in it, affordability way so yes abhishek this was it thank you for giving your time to me my probably pleasure. answering so many different questions uh, definitely audience i think you should definitely take out many things out of it we will anyhow put abhishek's linkedin id in the description of this particular video so that you can ask him any questions regarding transition abhishek please do help out if somebody is coming up with any kind of question definitely, sir, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. yeah so perfectly fine so guys this was it from my side i will see you all in the next video thank you abhishek uh, thank, thank you, you sir for coming. thank, thank sir. you thank you thank you